One of the biggest struggles growing up as a documented resident was definitely finding my own identity without letting my status affect who I am as a person. My name is Daniela and I work at Sephora. I am the senior artist so I get to inspire and elevate others' craft. I got to the U.S. when I was nine years old. My mom uh, wanted to come here to give us a better life. I remember her always working very hard to give us everything that we needed and what we wanted. Obviously, as a single mom coming in here and starting brand new, it's very hard. It's something that I know that it was not easy for her. So when we first moved here, we went to school, pretty much everything normal. Um, I think that I started seeing the effects of uh, being a undocumented resident when I got to my teenage years. But I knew that it was something that I couldn't really talk about because people can be cruel. Sometimes people will use things against you just to be mean. So I knew that it was something that we could only talk between myself, my mom, and my sister. In 2019, my mom was denied um, her residency um, after living here for 20 years and they told her that there was nothing else she could do that she had to go back and that was a time that was very hard I'm getting emotional um, it was a time that was very hard for me and my sister because like I said me and my mom and my sister were everywhere together um, she was my best friend After she left, um, my store director told me that I could take as much time as I needed for myself. And then when I went back to work, I can say that my Sephora family played a huge part. My store director was amazing. She was very, very supportive and very caring about the whole situation. And I think that being at work and seeing how much support I was getting, not only from my family, but from my Sephora family, it made me feel at ease and it made me feel like I wasn't alone. And, and because that's how I was feeling. I was feeling like I had lost part of myself when she left. I try to talk to my mom every single day. I try to make it feel like she never left. Transitioning to a completely different culture all over again, it's been hard for her. Hopefully we'll get to see her soon. We miss her a lot and I really want her to come back. And I know that one day we'll be a family together again.